New Gardener 47, take one. Hello! 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 <laughs> I've laid a lot of track now. I'm right down to the end here on both sides. This week I got all the way around the back of the tree, that bit that's held down with mortar, which means I've now got a continuous run from box end all the way up to the rockery. That means my next job is to close this loop here so it can come back again. Quick! <laughs> Two clowns are laying a model railway, one says the other. Does this angle look funny to you? The track that I've actually laid in the garden, I've messed about with the sleepers, which makes it look, or I've done it properly, makes it look a bit more narrow gauge, but unfortunately it means that it doesn't flex and hold its shape quite as well as an ordinary piece of flex track would, so this is a very tricky job indeed. <laughs> now having spent a little bit of time faffing about down there earlier, I realised that I need some track bed, which is kind of obvious really. I do need something to put the track on. It's just one of those things where I need to work it out as I go along, but at the moment I'm not really in the mood for that, so I'm going to do something slightly different now. These rocks down here, they don't really go with these rocks just here. And since I've made that gap where the new box plants used to go, I thought actually all the rocks of this kind of type I'd put over there and just keep them completely separate. So that means I've got a boring job to do. But it's all right for you, because you can have a train ride! I don't mind digging this over really, I mean, it's not like there's plants going down there. Well, I do need to put rocks on it. I don't need loose soil to put rocks on it. Let's rock this party. A lot of people complain about rockeries, that they look like someone's just got some rocks and just chucked them on the floor. Sometimes that's how it works. I've got his face stuck in the bag. Uh -huh.